total shock. Obviously, I'm thrilled to have received it. My main area of interest is that patients are human beings and you know they are often going through a very difficult time. And I suppose I try to um, try to do my best to make sure that we kind of cater for all those needs as a patient. So I believe our fourth or fifth year is sponsoring this award. So it's amazing that in these pressurised circumstances that they can still innovate and think of new ways to serve their patients. We've worked very hard this year. The girls have done a lot of um, innovative and clever and creative work. We're delighted that this has been recognised and we'd like to thank the sponsors and the Hospital Professional News for this award. It's a massive recognition of all the hard work that they've done and they have worked fastidiously over the years to improve and enhance their service and to make it as effective and as efficient and as safe as possible. So I am absolutely delighted they've won this award tonight. I suppose I'd just really like to say congratulations to all the finalists here this evening. Um, the applications and submissions were excellent. Fantastic initiative. Uh, we're delighted to uh, sponsor the award. We all work together to try and make it a better experience for the patient. And recently we looked at trying to make our, our times reduce, reduce our waiting times for patients and reduce by 30%. So um, to get this award, it's, it's just lovely to be um, acknowledged for all the hard work that we've done as a team.